Hey, what's going on dudes? It's Chaos. Welcome back to my Minecraft world. Hopefully you guys are doing awesome show. We are on the hunt today. We are on the prowl. We've got to go find some Podzel and I just, I need it man. I need it in my life. I need Podzel in my life right now and it'll just make me feel so much better, so much happier to know that I have Podzel in a chest sitting somewhere in my base that I probably won't use all that much, but the fact that we have Podzel uh, will make life awesome. So that's what we're doing today. Uh, we're doing a little bit of exploring. I haven't actually explored too, too much in this world, but uh, or at least in this amplified biome. So we're gonna go see what we can find. I've been traveling quite a ways already, and it seems like maybe we're on an island, which isn't so good. Uh, we're gonna head this way and see what we can find. But yeah, so spawn or our nordic village is probably about like three four five hundred blocks in that direction um so <laughs> yeah but uh anyways welcome back guys hopefully you guys are doing awesome and uh life has been good man just a little update some of you guys may know some of you may not but i am in the process of moving so next week this is like my last my last week in the apartment that i'm in right now um we get up there it's probably not too good of an idea oh um but yeah so this is like my last week last real week in oh not good i didn't mean to throw two okay uh but in the apartment that i'm in right now which is kind of weird man i've got everything all packed up my room is like empty um, except for my desk and my computer right now because I've been trying to work on doing some pre-recording for you guys while I am during the move uh, I'm not gonna have internet for a little while So I wanted to try to get as much done for you guys throughout the the couple of weeks that I don't have internet I just wanted to get some stuff done so uh, you guys can stay entertained while I am away But that's not going quite as well as I thought it was going to I've got some pre-recording stuff done, but um, it's a lot of stuff other than Minecraft, so I've got some thief, some thief, thief, pre-recorded and ready to go. Um, I've also got some Skyrim, which is uh, I'm super excited about. Something I've been more wanting to do for a while. Um, I've got the rest of the Elder Scrolls Online beta first impression series that I've been doing. Um, just a couple more videos in that. I didn't get as much time to play in the beta as I wanted to, but. Uh, I played enough to really kind of get a strong opinion about it, and I will be kind of doing an overview of my experience in the Elder Scrolls Online beta um, after that series is over. So there should be like two more episodes of gameplay, hopefully, um, and then there will be kind of like a, an overview review type thing after that. So uh, those will be coming out, like I said, along with Thief and Skyrim, Elder Scrolls V, and... Uh, I will have some Minecraft sprinkled in there, but I didn't get as much time as I wanted since uh, I've been pretty busy packing. I haven't been able to um, sit down and record like a ton, a ton of Minecraft stuff. It's easier with uh, games like Skyrim and Thief. I can just sit down and record for like three or four hours, uh, you know, and go and just get a lot of, lot of content produced um, and ready to go, like ready to upload and. Um, render and all that stuff, but with Minecraft, you know, there's a lot of like uh, background work that goes along with what what you got going on. Because you know, you got you got to build, you got to collect resources, and uh, all this other kind of stuff. But with Skyrim and Thief, you know, you kind of just you you just take it and go. So, uh, but yeah, so there'll be Minecraft kind of sprinkled in there throughout the next couple of weeks. Probably, I'm gonna try to do a Minecraft video like one every other day. Um, whether it's my Minecraft world, um, uh, Hypermine, Hypercraft, whatever, uh, Affinity and Technical Beasts, along with some Pixelmon. Pixelmon may be a little bit more frequent throughout the the weeks that I'm gone because I've been able to um, do a little bit of pre-recording with that. I'm going to try to record some of that tonight after this, and uh, that should be a lot of fun, man. I've got a lot of high hopes for the Pixelmon series. It's going to be it's gonna be awesome. I'm so pumped for Pixelmon. Um, 
<laughs> it's pixel mod is just one of those mods that it's just it's fun to play you know it's not like normal minecraft you can just get on and go and um catch your pokemon and do whatever you know there's not a ton of resource gathering involved so you know you don't have to worry about mobs you don't have to worry about hunger uh, so you don't have to really worry about setting up farms and um you know you just your normal vanilla minecraft stuff is a kind of a thing of the past but uh i don't know we're she but anyways it looks like I don't know what is going on or where I am right now. I really wish I could find something nice, but this may be quite a journey trying to find uh trying to find some puzzle. It may be a problem. Let's see if we can knock this up. Oh, no, nope, we didn't knock him off. Did I have knockback on this? I don't. It's just sharpness five. Hmm. That looks kinda cool down there, not gonna lie. I love the amplified biomes, man. This stuff is unreal. The terrain generation is just so cool to look at. Like, it really kind of sucks though because like you pick a spot and you're like, okay, I'm gonna build here, and then you go start exploring and you find all these other spots that are like really awesome, and you wish you maybe would have set up some buildings over here. Look at all these guys down there though. Holy cow! Mushrooms on sand. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Looks like there's some new stone down there too. Interesting. Um, you think we can take these guys? Maybe. I don't want to die out here. That's the only problem. Um, let's give it a shot. Oh no! I need my sword. Okay, you blow up. Kill that guy. There's a lot of y'all around here. Jeez. Ah! Ambush. Uh, okay, okay, now we just got the skeletons to worry about. Get out of here. Go on. Oh, no, no. He's got something on his bow. He's got something major on his bow. Get out of here. Or do you? Is this normal knockback? Jeez. Okay, so, hi, guy. We, just, we came, we saw, we conquered. That's what's up. <laughs> um, Anything good down here? Doesn't look like it. Some of the new stone, but I've got enough of this, and I'm still waiting, Mojang, for the texture to be updated because it's ugly. As of right now, I don't like it. It's super ugly. Uh, let's see what's up in here. This is not where Puzzle would reside, but um, you know, it's worth it's worth a peek. Oh, there's witches. Not good. Uh, oh, hi, witch. Okay. Oh, she almost got us. Oh, she did get us. What did you get? slowness? No. Hmm, okay, so it's real easy to get kind of turned around in these things. Where's I hear this witch coming. Oh, we, we just dodged her. Where did we come from? Over there? Had to have been. Huh. Um, you know what? Let's sleep. Let's just sleep real quick. Let's sleep the night away and we'll wake up nice and refreshed in the morning. And we'll be good to go on our hunt for Podzo. See, you see what I did there? I, I changed the way you say it to rhyme. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so this could be quite the journey. I'm not getting any lag, so it makes me think that I've been here before. Um, because typically when these, these chunks render in with the uh, amplified terrain, it can cause quite the stutter. So... I don't know if we've been here before, and uh, this is all stuff that I've seen or something. I don't remember. But I guess I will continue on just a little bit until I find some Podzo or something else quite interesting. So, uh, anyways, I will be on the move, and I will be back in just a few minutes. Yeah, this place is epic, man. <laughs> I hate this. Like, I find all these cool spots. I mean, man, I want to build there. I want to do something really cool. But I can't just abandon the project that I've already started. Um, <laughs> like, look at this place, man. Like, the super, super duper hangovers and um, all this stuff. It's, like, so cool. But I think we're getting kind of hot on the trail of this Podzo. Um, we're starting to get a little bit closer into some of the greener climates here. Um, so, hopefully, I think... It kind of grows around like the green stuff and the cold stuff, right? I believe. Uh, a lot of pigs over here, though. But there was snow over that way, like on the other side of this mountain. So maybe that's the direction we should go. 
and see what they got going on, but I'm not sure. We're kind of really high up right now. I am really high up. <laughs> um, and we'll see what they got going on. So there's another roof forest over here. So I think we're getting closer. I need to find like a taiga. I think it's called like the the mega taiga, right? Is the one that have the podzle in it, I think. We may have to do some research. Oops. Um, let's get this out of the way. I'm just about out of ender pearls. I got more in my ender chest, which is uh, <laughs> for all those of you worried. I have ender pearls. Don't you worry. Uh, okay. Okay, so I guess I will continue on, and when we find a taiga, we're going to be searching the whole taiga, like the edges of it, trying to find the mega taiga, the elusive mega taiga. <gasps> Guys, sunflowers. This was like the one flower I was missing. Look at that cave over there. That's cool. Man, this is a, ah, this is a sweet spot. Uh, let's, let's hijack some of these sunflowers, man. We're going to grab as many as we can with six bone meal. So I guess that would be like six, right? Uh, let's take this guy over here. There's only two in this little area right here. So maybe there's more that I'm just not seeing, but I don't know where they're at. Uh, so we got this little patch of sunflower plains right here. And uh, we're going to bone meal the crap out of these guys. So we've got a total of eight sunflowers, um, which is better than what I had. So I had zero, I think. Pretty sure sunflower was like the one flower that I hadn't found yet, so got that under our belt. Check. Um, now we just need Podzo. Podzo. Uh, looks like we're. I get a bunch of lag too. You see my Ender Pearl? I don't know what that's about. That's weird. Uh, let's head up there. Yeah, watch my Ender Pearl. See? That starts floating back and forth. That takes forever. I don't know what's up with that. It's so weird. I don't know if it's because I'm in the new, um, generating new terrain or what. So I've been kind of reluctant to start generating a bunch of new terrain because of some of the changes and stuff that's going to be made to the game in 1.8. But as far as I can tell, there shouldn't be too many, too many more terrain generation, um, updates or changes with the upcoming patch. So um, we'll just roll with it. Hopefully we don't have any problems. Let's see if we can make it down there. Looks like we have chunk errors here. Or is this just flat? Oh, okay. So it doesn't look like a chunk error. It's just flat. Man, this place looks cool, though. Like the super caves and everything. Oh, I love it. I mean, like, really? Who wouldn't want to live here? Who want Who wouldn't want to build here? You know? Uh, okay. Don't kill us, please. Thank you. Alright, well, I guess I will continue on. This is going to take forever. I can already tell. Yeah. Yep, this game is tempting me. Uh, look at this place. Like, the super epic waterfall and everything. The cave. This reminds me of, like, the old school terrain gen from, like, the beta 1.7.3 like when I first started um, you had all these crazy overhangs and stuff like this it was so much fun and uh, just that everything was just so cool looking uh, this is uh, I hate it I hated we already picked a place okay so we have to build something here this is too good of a spot this would be like a secret island lagoon or something man look at this uh, I hate it. All right, so we definitely had to come back and build something here. Look at this place. This is too cool to pass up. Um, let's see if we can get over there. It's like just a single island that goes all the way up in the sky. That barely connects over here. Yep, this is too cool to pass up. We are definitely going to build something over here. I will nether portal my way all the way back over here. I took a picture of the cords, so uh, it would be... It would be a project for us to work on. Still no freaking taiga, though. I have no idea what's going to happen or if this is going to happen at all. There has to be a taiga around here somewhere. But it is eluding me. Where did I throw this from? Every time I enderpearl, I get turned around, man. 
Uh, just because these mountains are so big. So it had to have been from over this way. Ooh, you dropped lots of gunpowder. Yeah, okay, so there's the island there. Okay, oh, okay, so we just came up through that little hole. I see. Said the blind man, I see. So, uh, probably one more cut, and I will keep, I will continue on, man. I will continue fighting. Um, be strong. There's a snowy biome right here. So hopefully we find something soon. All right, well, I'm pretty positive this is flipping impossible. So I have been searching and searching and searching, and there is nothing at all. I found, I got really excited because I found an Extreme Hills Plus biome um, that apparently when way up high, there's a lot of snow because of the height. But apparently they also like to troll you by spawning in spruce wood trees. So apparently in the Extreme Hills Plus biomes, you can find the <laughs> uh, the spruce trees. And it is really aggravating because I want to find this taiga biome. But apparently there isn't one here at all. Um, and I still have to make my way home. I have absolutely no idea where I am or who we are or I've lost my memory since we've left it's been so long <laughs> um, hopefully we come across something soon it looks like we're ger generating new terrain now or it feels like it anyway hi horse horses horsies um, but still absolutely no sign of taiga biomes and it's driving me nuts man I've been running around forever the only thing I'm wondering about is when we started this world way back in like 1.3 or whatever it was. Um, get out of here. No, it was earlier than that. What was it? It was like, I don't remember what it was. Whenever the uh, the large biomes came into play. What is this? What is this? What is this? Snow? Ex extreme hills. Damn it. Oh, here we go. New terrain being loaded in. Uh, but yeah, when we started this world forever ago, it was like right as they introduced the large biomes. Um, now, I've done some tweaking in order to get the amplified biomes to generate in this world. Uh, but I don't know if the large biome, like the code for the large biomes, has stuck around. Or if it's just amplified terrain now. Because um, some of these biomes seem fairly large. For, oh, oh, that was so close. You see that? Pro jumps right there. That's for sure. Um... But yeah, I don't know if the the large biomes got to stick around. But some of these biomes seem really big, so it could be a possibility. And that would make things really difficult to find as well because um, the when they were talking about large biomes, man, they weren't kidding. These Those biomes are huge. So hopefully we'll find something soon. I feel like I'm hot on the trail, but um, I could be running in circles. Dudes! I had to take a break for like an hour and then come back and I still haven't found anything. This is about the most interesting thing that I've found so far and I feel like the population of mushrooms in this swamp biome are a little crazy. <laughs> I don't know if this is what uh, normal swamp biomes look like now but there is a ton of mushrooms all over the place so I thought that was kind of crazy. Uh, but I may have to give up on trying to find Podzil at least for now because... I have looked far and wide and traveled distances across the lands and I have not found anything. I found a couple of taiga biomes, but so far no, none of the mega taiga biomes. And we're out here gen generating new terrain, so maybe it'll be just like right around the corner. Um, I'm hoping, but I still have not found anything. But jeez, look at all the mushrooms, man. I feel like that's not normal. <laughs> that's, this is a lot of mushrooms. Uh, it just looks weird to me. But, uh... I don't know. Let's search around here a little bit. And if we don't find a taiga, I may go ahead and call today's episode. Um, because this is getting a little ridiculous. I would like to go record some other stuff. And I didn't think this was going to take that long. But I have been at this for... Well over an hour now. Um, a little bit longer than that, probably. An hour and a half. I don't know, maybe it's even been longer than that. I don't know. But this is getting nuts, man. Oh, oh. This is a cool swamp biome, though. See, this is like, this is more normal. 
Not as many mushrooms. But over there, that was a lot of mushrooms. I'm going to take a screenshot of the coordinates here. Uh, oops. There we go. And oops, wrong button. Jeez. Okay. We may have to come back and uh, take a look at this again. But hopefully, ah, I'm out of ender pearls too. Hopefully, we can find a freaking. Um, I'll put some of this crap away too. Come on, man. My in my inventory is like full, full up on stuff. Um, we really don't need any of this stuff, but whatever. Uh, but yeah, this is getting nuts, man. So if you guys have any, I don't know. I like I swear we found a a, a mega tiger before, but I like didn't have silk touch or something to harvest it. I feel like that's the case, but I don't remember. I just maybe getting it mixed up with somebody else's video or something like that. But this is getting ridiculous. Been finding a ton of these birchwood forests, but this is not what we want, man. This is not at all what we want. Anything up here? Generating new terrain. All right, well, I guess here's what's going to happen. I'm going to continue to look for a mega taiga biome so we can find this freaking podzol this episode. But I will give this about like another 20 minutes. And if I don't find anything in that time frame, I'm going to have to end today's episode because I don't have all day. <laughs> uh, okay, so hopefully we'll be back with some Podzil. Hey, so check this out. This is about the coolest thing I've seen in a long time. I've got a trivia question for you guys. And if you know the answer, ooh, what is up with you? Look up again. Hey. <laughs> that's kind of a bug thing in the snapshot but uh yeah so i want to know if you guys know what the percentage is that a pink sheep will naturally spawn in the world like what's the uh i don't know let's say like a, a white sheep is a, a white sheep is like a hundred percent there is an actual number out there for the chances of a pink sheep spawning in the real world. Is this a second one? <laughs> what is up, dude? That is pretty nuts. Um, why are there so many pink sheep around here? There's a third one over there. Let's go look at this. So, that's interesting. But yeah, like, I okay, leave your, leave your answer in the comments down below because I want to know. It's a trivia question for you. Um, if you win, you win. <laughs> I don't really have anything to give you. Is that a mega tag over there? I don't think it is. I came from that way. Pretty sure. But uh yeah, I thought that was interesting, so I thought I'd share that with you guys. I am still on the hunt. Hopefully, we're getting closer now. I think we are, hopefully. But uh yeah, so I will continue on. Three pink sheep, dude. That's crazy. Well, I give up. I give up. I absolutely give up. There is no point in going on. Life is over. There is no Podzol to be found in my world, apparently. So, I am going to go ahead and end today's episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this random adventure that we just went on. We didn't really even find anything cool. I mean, we found some cool spots, but no treasures, no Podzol, no nothing. We got some new stone. It's all over the place, but I don't need any of that. I need Podzol, and Podzol is non-existent so anyways i'm going to go ahead and go this episode is taking way too long i will continue to look around when i have time uh since i'm all the way out here and i have hopefully another stack of ender pearls in my ender chest but if i do not well it may be game over for me for a little while so <laughs> uh anyways if you would hit that like button for me down below subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you guys next time for some more in my Minecraft world, hopefully with a little bit more uh, productivity going on, because I felt like today we just walked around a lot and we had some fun. We had we had some fun. I won't lie. Um, it was nice to go out and explore and see the world for what it is. But um, you know, there's always that end game. You're always you always need to get some stuff. There's some cheaty water. Hi. Um, <laughs> but. We need puzzle. So, if you haven't already, go back and, or if you don't know, 
I guess go back and watch my videos. Let me know if we found Podzol or not, because if we did, I would like to know where that is in my world, and I could use it. I would love to have Podzol. But, uh, <laughs> anyways, I'm going to go before I lose my mind completely, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode, right? Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Peace.